It's March 1st, 2018, and this is an experiment for a laser photoelectric using a beam splitter. It's kind of a proof of concept. And basically this is what this setup is doing. There's a laser that's emitting light through the beam splitter. It travels to a first surface mirror. It's reflected back hits a beam splitter reflected down into a detector. That's the basic setup. And what I'm using is a red laser. I'm using a beam splitter that is salvaged out of an old CD-ROM drive. DVD drive, I should say. This is a first surface mirror and the detector is a photometer here. It's not calibrated and I'm only using it for relative measurements. The detector head is here, connected to the photometer. So basically, here's the red laser. It's emitting the light through the beam splitter. The light is traveling out to this mirror, and it's reflected back through the beam splitter and down onto the detector. And you can see that when I block the light, if I can get the meter in the view here, you can see the meter responding. I'm blocking the light beam in the path between the laser and beam splitter and the mirror. And the detector is detecting that change in light intensity. Eventually what will be in place of this detector will be a phototransistor or some type of a photo sensitive semiconductor that will uh, measure the light, amplify it, and then process it. Real crude setup here and it's very hard to adjust it so now that I know this works I'm gonna build a apparatus on my light bench that I can make real fine adjustments as you can see just touching this barely really really changes the light intensity just barely have to touch it anyway this is the first experiment with the um, using the beam splitter the laser's running about 24 milliamps at 5 volts. Stand by for the next experiment where we should have it on the on the um, optics bench. Bye for now.